Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Hello to everybody. My name is Tengku Muaz bin Tengku Bahizal Sah. I'm from UITM Cawangan Pulau Pinang, Campus Pematampau. Today I will present about innovation in local kueh consumer behavioral attentions toward ready-made frozen food RMFF. So this is what we will go through from my presentations. So we go to the introductions. The frozen food sectors in Malaysia has seen a surge in demand in recent years as a result of the country rapid urbanizations and rising urbanization witnesses the high demand for frozen food in Malaysia increase. Level of income and employment also play an essential role in increasing demand on the ready-made frozen food RMFF. <clears throat> Malaysian frozen food manufacturer deals with variety of important food such as frozen meat, seafood, vegetable, fresh fruit, ready meat meals, beverage, snacks, um, local delicacies, kueh, and many more. So according to scene 2019, they have five factors that contribute the growth and the demand for the frozen food industry. The first one as a result of changing lifestyle, as a result of globalization, global organizations, there is a growing appetite for ready to cook food products, the growing numbers of working women, the increased availability of freezing medium uh, is expected to boost the expansions of the frozen enterprise around the world, the expanding popularity of a food, a fast food and western culture in Asia Pacific emerged the economy. And the last one is abundant choice of the frozen food available. So, according to the Stewart Nock, Michelle 2003 and Van, Van Honecker 2013, traditional food have received a lot of attention from uh, food manufacturer, food companies and government, government entities to maintain or increase market share and profitability. The conventional food sectors like all other in the food business must continue to adapt and grow, in, in, uh, grow its goods. Small, medium enterprise uh, companies (SME) food companies must innovate in order to ensure the long-term viability of local food frozen productions, and they also have to develop appropriate strategies for successful new product development (NDP) and ha has hesitated a greater level considerations, and they also have to make uh, innovate the products that meet the consumer expectations, the consumer preference. Um, uh, uh, to make it uh, the, the local food better uh, for the consumer. So we go to the literature review. The first one is uh, local uh, Malaysian local kuih. Malaysia is a food paradise, and Malaysia embraces their diversity. Malaysia represents country with many groups, uh, ethnic groups. Kuih delicacies play an important components of Malaysia identity, culture. And gastronomy history, a traditional Malaysian cuisine stay over time. Consumer increase the demand on unique food uh, ideas, and then uh, kueh is accepted as a snack and can be included in feasts or festivities. Uh, it also has a variety small from delicate uh, pastries or bakeries, steam or grill, and have a sweet or savory taste. It also can be available in appetizer, salad, dessert, and snack. And one of the delicacies that can be served in a, as appetizer, dessert, and snack. This is one of the uh, products that have been innovated um, by one of SMEs in the northern uh, area of Malaysia. And we go to the second literature review is food innovation. Food innovation is referred to improve an ex of existing product uh, and process as well inventions new product and process uh, to produce healthier and safer products novel process technique has been used and to uh, and can dairy frozen industry create more added value uh, to the rmff so we go to the ready-made frozen food rmff freezing is one of the oldest and the most extensive use preservation technique and ready-made frozen food snacks are prepared pre-packaged are fresh or frozen snacks that just uh, require heating before serving. Ready-made frozen food is a uh, food that has been properly packaged and prepared for consumption. According to Howard, they have two essential motivate that uh, motivation that inspire a uh, buyer to purchase quick meal. The first one is convenience and ease of usage. The second one is, is saving the time. 
so this is one this is uh, the example of innovations uh, on uh, local kuih you can see the uh, innovations on um, uh, packaging if you can see the, pa the packaging is quite attractive huh? attractive packaging and the packaging also include uh, the nutritional facts manufacturer info and uh, expired date so uh, about this uh, research this research using uh, theory plan behavior TPB okay and we can go we can see the independent variable we have four attitudes have you know perceived behavior control innovations and dependent variable we have uh, intention to buy so we have two uh, research objective and two research question the first one for the research objective is to identify factor that influence consumer behavioral intentions to ready-made a local delicacies quick ready-made frozen food to determine the relationship between factors that influence consumer behavioral intentions toward purchasing local delicacies quick ready-made frozen food or mff for the research question we have what uh, the factors influence consumer behavioral attentions toward purchasing local delicacies, ready-made frozen food or MFF, and what are the relationship between uh, factors uh, that influence consumer behavioral attentions toward purchasing local uh, delicacies, kue or kue, ready-made frozen food or MFF. So for the methodology, this research using quantitative. Uh, quantitative and our survey our survey sampling technique use non probability purposive uh, sampling and we are focusing on the <coughs> Penang residents we focus only Penang residents in Ireland and uh, we are using <coughs> power analysis G power software uh, for this uh, for this research we use uh, e survey uh, distribute using a Google form and send through WhatsApp, Facebook, and email. For the instru instrumentation, uh, we are using a five point liquid skill and adopt adopted items. And for the uh, uh, question, we have bi language survey, we are using Bahasa Malaysia and English. For the questionnaire development, we have one screening question, six sections, and 30 items. Data management, we are using uh, SPSF, SPSS Vision 21 with descriptive data analysis, correlations, and multi regression. Uh, so we can see that um, from the result, uh, uh, respondent result, uh, okay, um, female respondent were found to be majority by 54.6. Uh, compared to males, the majority respondent were between age uh, 20 to 29 uh, with 64.5% uh, and the most of respondents uh, are single status martial with 58.2% with 24.8% uh, uh, were professional worker. Uh, this show that uh, the younger generation was interested in buying frozen local kuih. But why respondent with uh, uh, monthly income, household income with uh, 2,000 to 3,000 were the highest consumer purchase, uh, purchase local ready-made frozen food or MFF. So 92.8 pinning it, pinning it or pinning resident buy frozen food. Uh, buy frozen local quick from two main uh, hypermarket with this giant hypermarket and um, Maiden hypermarket, so we can see that uh, based on that, majority being it prefer frozen popia, cook pao, and curry pao. We can see that popia have 65.71 percent, and the second highest one is pao 58.59.28 uh, percent, and curry pao 58.57 percent. So, uh, from the result, we can see from the correlations, uh, we can see that we have a uh, value that. 0.266 okay 0.266 is a small almost moderate strange positive correlations uh, because this value is positive why we have 0.001 level significant for correlation is 0.05 low than 0.05 that's mean is enough evidence to suggest that the correlation we observe does exist um, does exist in the populations okay so we can see that we have 63% uh, okay for the adjust R square uh, subjective norm 
Okay, the regression finding show that model summary, subjective norm, attitude, perceived behavior control, and innovation explain 63% of the variations. And this model was the most significant predictor. Okay, what I can conclude that is gen in general, this study demonstrate that consumers were open towards innovations and they are willing to buy local delicacies, ready-made frozen food, or MFF. The key drivers for uh, increased demand um, in local kue, uh, ready-made frozen food, or MFF, demographic factors, the first one is gender. Male and female do shopping consider, considering be different motivate perspective, rational and considerations. The second one is age. Different reach of age may have different opinion and lifestyle, occupations, people, food choice, behavior depend on professions. Um, these results are expected to highlight that significant of innovation's role in continuing and sustaining the, multi, uh, uh, the Malaysian local delicacies or kuih, ready-made frozen food, or MFF against the global, globalizations. Continuous and proactive effort uh, need to be taken by society, academics, government and food service industry to ensure continuous sustainability in, uh, of Malaysia local uh, kuih, ready-made frozen food, or MFF. Hence, it may also have a positive impact on uh, the Mal Malaysian local delicacies, ready-made frozen food, or MFF, food business, and tourist food, uh, tourism food heritage um, industry in the future. That's all uh, from my presentations. Thank you for your attentions. Uh, Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.